Hello everyone, Johnny here. Today in this session, we will try to solve how to split an array based upon the length. It means uh, we should able to have have a function where it will accept first argument as an array and second argument as a length of the size which we want to split. Suppose let me write an example first. First suppose I want to write a function here. I just want to write a function where in this function it should have two things first one would be the argument first argument where it will try to uh, have an array here and next one would be the size for suppose I have, an, I have an array like this a comma b comma sorry a comma b comma c comma d when I give the size as 2 here it means it should be able to return the output as a comma b next one c comma d that's all so in order to write this code we need some basic uh, methods to solve this so i just need to accept an array and a size where uh, two indicates here size you can put any of the size i have just mentioned here as two so when the user gives the input like this uh, array followed by the size it should be able to segregate it in the sense it should be able to split it first one let us learn about push in this we will be using first method called push push see i have an array here if i want to push an element to the end of an array if i want to insert an element to the into the array then we can use a method called push for suppose i have something like this a comma b comma c comma d a comma b comma c comma d and i have uh, console.log console.log a dot push off I have written something like e e here so what does it mean we are trying to insert an element called e we are trying to insert an element called e here so where did we where did we write b b is not defined where did I write b line number 16 where is b here Where did we like B? Okay, sorry. So when the array is in the form of a, I just need to enclose this, right? Now we will get. So uh, it is trying to return the length now. So the list of elements. But suppose if I have written console dot log of A, console dot log of A. So we got all the array elements: zero for A, one for B, two for C, three for d and uh, 4 for e but the length would be 5 so we got how to push an array element now mm, let, uh, let me write an example for slice what is the use of slice uh, for example I, if i want to cut a piece of bread like we use some uh, we will try to segregate into different parts like in the same way i have, I have some elements here i have some some, some elements here example uh, k equals to hello i just want to write h e l l and o i just want to write like this some i have written this now i want to use something called a split console dot log k dot splice what is this uh, we are trying to learn about a uh, slice right so once you use a slice then we can write the size of it first one indicates from where we need to start i have written something called zero comma next one indicates where we need to end for suppose if i have written two here it means it will start from zero and it will end at one not at two in the sense it will start from zero one but it will not include the last index it will not include in the sense it will try to exclude in the sense it will not include the last value here sorry it splice okay so once you have if i have written like this so if you can see here we got only 0 and 1 here the 2 will not be considered it will not consider so first uh, first will try to give us first argument will try to say us from where we need to start and the next one will try to tell the end value but it doesn't includes it doesn't includes these are the two basic methods which are required in order to solve this 
uh, how to split an array based upon the array and the size. Now let us write some code. So let me put everything in the comments. Let me put everything in the comments. Now let me write a small code where we will try to use this. First let me define a function here. Uh, I want to define this function as split array. I just want to define this function as split array. See as we have discussed like uh, we will try to call this function. So we will try to call this function. So let me write split array here. In this array let me pass first parent. So let me pass the same thing or else it would be fine. Let me pass the same array. But see here uh, just now we are, it should be enclosed in the quotes. So I have a string a b c d like sorry array a b c d uh, which is in the form of characters. So here I have mentioned the size as 2 here. I have mentioned the size as 2. Now I should able to pass this array as well as the size. So let me define the parameters as array and size. So I have defined the array and size. First let me consider the final array as an empty. Let me consider the final array. Final array as empty now. As of now I just want to consider the final array in the form of empty. Next one, I just want to define the size of, uh, for example, I have something called split here and I am trying to initialize with 0. In the sense, whatever the array which we want to cut, whatever the array which we want to remove, it is initialized with a 0 now. Now, I am trying to use a while loop here where first it will try to consider the cut length. In the sense, uh, what is the length we are trying to cut in the sense we want to split that is array split if it is less than array dot length if it is less than array dot length for suppose if the split is less than and the sense 0 is less than array dot length in the sense what would be the array length here 4 so 0 is less than 4 yes so if the condition is satisfying it will try to execute the while block in this while block first I will try to insert an element in the sense I will try to push an element here so how could I push? I can write, sorry it is final array, final array dot push, final array dot push, array dot slice, array dot slice. In this array dot slice, first one I would like to pass the value of split in the sense automatically what would the size of here? 0. No, so I am just writing here as split comma, split comma. I just want to write the first one as a index that is a 0th value and next one I want to write split plus size it means we are trying to make sure that whatever the elements we are trying to put we are trying to use a slice operation here slice operation for, so what would be the output of the only this statement for suppose if it is satisfying this condition so here the array dot slice split comma spl split plus size it means first the array size here is 0 comma 2 it means it will try to so this indirectly will try to retry this will indirectly try to retry a comma b only the first values that is a comma b first array dot slice of this what we have written in the push will try to retry a comma b there so automatically a comma b will be retrieved now inside this uh, split is done. Now if I want to write again cut length equals to <coughs> I just want to increment the size here. So I just want to write cut length plus size here. So what does it mean? Now we are trying to increase the size and it will start from 2 comma the size. 2 comma 2 in the sense uh, when we write 2 comma the size so here what it will be now the split size split will be split size will be of based upon the array length like uh, cut length is equal to it it is indirectly equals to zero so what is the cut length we haven't taken any variable right let me take here sorry let me take here split so indirectly it will be equals to zero first one in the first iteration it will be zero plus two zero plus two so now what is the value of split here? It is 2. Now it will try to compare with here. Again, 2 less than 4. 
yes so again it will try to pass the value here 2 comma 2 plus 2 what is the 2 plus 2 here so 2 comma 4 so it will consider 2 3 4 value will not be considered so it will try to return c c comma d if you can understand this one in the first iteration it will be 0 comma 2 in the next iteration it will be 2 comma 4 2 comma 4 because the split value has been assigned with the new value that is 2 comma 4 so based upon that it will try to iterate now at the end if i want to return the elements i just want to return the final array here so we can return final array that's all so once you have done this you will understand so first let me check the output in the console so we didn't get any output because see we just need to write console.log here nothing so automatically we will try to get out see we got array first one a comma b next one c comma d so let me write the same logic for again some other array let me write some other array here. so let me write z comma e comma okay now i want to split this array based upon the length that is 3 i want to split the length based upon the 3 now if you can calculate it see we got z e a and b c d so let us elaborate the same logic again what we have written first it will try to pass this array in the uh, r and size will be 3 now the final array is empty now split is 0 so here 0 less than what is the array length here 6 0 less than 6 very good now inside this it will try to execute this loop so for in the first iteration in the first iteration in the sense first loop execution the slice of split let me enlarge this okay so splice of if you can see in the single statement then you will understand yes let me put this in the comments and i will let you know so here array dot slice split to comma split plus size it means first iteration it will have slice of it means slice of what is the split here 0 comma what is the size here 3 so 0 comma 3 so it will try to uh, truncate not truncate it will try to split z 0 1 and 2 as we have discussed slice will not consider the last value here so in the first iteration it will be z e a now after this what will what would be the value here uh, so whatever the slice elements we have uh, removed uh, we have sliced it will try to push in the new array that is final array now here split plus is equal to size it means it will try to have the value like this split equals i have written shorthand notation here split the plus size so indirectly it is equals to 0 plus 3 now the size is 3 in the next iteration in the next iteration now it will be slice of 3 comma what is the size here uh, first it is 3 so 3 plus the size what we have so it will try to repeat 6 so 3 plus 6 in indicates 3, 4 and 5. It will not include the last value. You got it right. Now the size we here the split will have the value of 3 plus 3 is 6. So which is uh, 6 and array length is also 6. So it is false. So it will try to return the final array. Hope you are clear with this somewhat basic example. In order to segregate or in order to split based upon the size and a given array. If you have any queries in this, you can just comment below this video. In the description part, you will find the complete JavaScript series and projects. Thank you.